30 caliber rifle cartridges have long been a top choice for American hunters in pursuit of big game. That's a major reason why large receiver ARs chambered for the 308 Winchester have become so popular. The Smith & Wesson M&P 10 Sport is one AR that offers hunters the kind of performance they need for burly whitetails and heavy hogs, black bears, and even elk. And it's why we're taking a closer look at it this week on American Hunters Sunday Gun Day. The M&P 10 Sports 308 Winchester chambering of course requires larger, heavier receivers and internal components than found on an AR-15, and so it weighs more. Even so, Smith & Wesson keeps its weight to about 8 pounds, which is reasonable for a general purpose hunting rifle. Perhaps just as important for carrying through tight timber or thick brush, the overall length of the M&P Sport is less than 38 inches, even with the 6 position buttstock fully extended. With the length of pull properly adjusted, the rifle will measure closer to 36 inches for most hunters. For reference, many bolt action hunting rifles in 308 Winchester are more than 40 inches long. Smith & Wesson reduces the overall length mainly by giving the M&P 10 Sport a 16 inch barrel. Sure, this lowers velocity, but with today's bullets, rangefinders, and scopes, the difference shouldn't be much of a concern at typical hunting ranges. Two other noteworthy features of the barrel include 5R rifling with angular sided lands that reportedly reduce fouling and an Armornite treatment on the exterior and interior. Armornite is a hardened nitride finish that increases resistance to corrosion and wear. Like on most ARs, the buttstock and pistol grip are equally suited to both right-handed and left-handed shooters, but Smith & Wesson goes a step further in making the M&P 10 Sport fully ambidextrous by placing safety levers, bolt catches, and magazine releases on both sides of the rifle. The mid-length gas tube is covered by a synthetic handguard that attaches via a conventional delta ring. Nothing fancy here, just a perfectly useful and comfortable place to grip the front of the rifle without getting gouged by the accessory rails common to aluminum handguards. The composite material is a bit less resident than aluminum in the chance it comes in contact with metal parts of a tree stand and the handguard's straightforward design is less expensive to manufacture, which shows in the M&P 10 Sport's retail price of about $1,000. The M&P 10 Sport does come with a railed gas block, which serves as a mounting platform for a front sight. Most hunters will probably shrug at this notion and mount a scope instead, which is just as easy to accomplish thanks to a rail integral to the upper receiver. If you want both optic and irons, there's enough room on the receiver to accommodate a scope mount and a folding rear sight. The gas block includes a sling swivel, while the buttstock has both a metal ring and a slot to complete sling attachment. In short, the Smith & Wesson M&P 10 Sport has everything a big game hunter, whether right-handed or left-handed, needs for the field without adding unnecessary extras that drive up the price. It may be the best value hunters will find in the company's entire M&P line. For more information on Smith & Wesson's M&P 10 Sport, go to smith-wesson.com. And for more Sunday Gun Day, any day of the week, check out AmericanHunter.org.